up, Paris gang? Today, 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 today. Like Brian and James would say. Oh, um, before we get into this video, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, share this video with everybody y'all know. That y'all know. Everybody y'all. Because we're trying to get to 70K. You already know. Run them numbers up. But we got a crazy, crazy, story crazy time. story time for y'all today, y'all. So, um, on Labor Day, which was like what? So, today is Friday. Labor Day was Monday. Damn, it was Monday? No, it was Sunday. It was Monday. Oh, it was Monday. Okay. So, yeah, Labor Day was on Monday and something crazy happened. I don't know if y'all was in our live, but... I don't know. Some of y'all was probably in our live and y'all seen we was having a good time. It was a good day. Y'all seen on the video prior to this one. Um, I had went to the gym that morning. I was tired. I was sweaty. I was jittery. It was just like a lot going on. We was rushing, trying to get to the barbecue at um, her sister house. And when I got there, I went to sit down. After I was on live, after we was on live together, I went, I sat down, was waiting for Coco to make me a plate. And I guess, because I don't remember... I guess I end up passing out. Yeah, so happened, she passed out, y'all. I was at the microwave making her play. My cousin um, actually seen her. They thought she was laughing at our friend with her baby. And, like, you know, we thought she was engaging. But the entire time, she was, like, gasping for air, and she fell back. My sister has a bar stop, so she fell back and um, hit her head and fainted, passed out. But that's not the crazy part. The crazy part is... Um, we we started to call 911, but she woke back up and everything seemed fine. We tested her and everything, she seemed fine. So then we moved her to the couch, and I come downstairs from getting her a towel, and she she feeling her head because she like, dang, I'm sweating, I'm hot. She was real hot and sweaty. It was come sweat to find literally out, all over my body. Like, come to find crazy. out, you guys, she busted her head open. Yeah, like I had to. I went to because they laid me back on the couch i went to touch my hair right here and it was like blood all on my hand i was like what the fuck so when i woke up when i came to i just seen all these people standing around me i was like what she the was fuck? freaking out i was freaking out i was yeah, like i know how they yell she was like we about to call 911 i'm like call 911 don't fucking call 911 like i instantly like low-key got mad and i was like no don't call the police you know so they went, they sat me on the couch, and then, like I said, I touched my head, and I seen the blood, and then she was like, you wanted me to call the ambulance, and I'm like, at first, I still was like, no, and then I just started being, like, in pain more and more, and then finally, I was like, yeah. So, but the ambulance came, they took me to the, um, see the hospital, sign on, yeah, and so, basically, we give me all, like, a little back story of what y'all about to see, because after that, we kind of start recording the and whole little situation and y'all gonna see everything that happened we basically telling y'all this story to tell y'all make sure y'all stay hydrated make sure y'all eating and all that because that's basically what happened to me at the barbecue yeah it was liquor everybody was chilling smoking and drinking and all that but i was not doing none of that shit like i was not drinking or nothing and that shit happened to me really fast y'all it was yeah. very hot that day this never happened to her it, it never happened to me so like you know we be thinking like because we young this can't happen to us stay hydrated y'all remember if you drinking pre-workout do yo yeah do I had yo, um, that morning she drank pre-workout that morning do y'all research on the pre-workout because sometimes like you know she came home saying she felt jittery but we yeah. just shook it off because the gym was packed and she didn't do her full hour yeah i just well usually i'll stay in the gym for like longer than an hour and after i drink my pre-workout i'll make sure i drink a lot a lot of water but we was in such a rush to get to where we was trying to go that i didn't come home drink my water take my time wind down and do all that so it was just like a lot going on that day and it's so crazy because in the video before this i was telling them like i don't never slow down and just take my time and then i fucking end up having out like it was crazy so y'all just i take got care three yourself. staples in, in my head, head right now y'all so gonna, gonna see it on here yeah, we're not on gonna the camera. kill the video so but... i gotta go a week from now and get them taken out so yeah, yeah. well sunday this sunday yeah so we actually yeah um but yeah y'all this is basically like hopefully it's like educational purposes it can help you because we were very scared i didn't know she wasn't moving it was just scary so the video is pretty sped up it's just events and it's gonna be a quick short little video but we gonna post this and y'all she's fine she feels fine after she came from cedar sinai the next day we went to the va hold on y'all speaking of the hospital that i was just that i was at for this little incident 
just called me right now trying to have me do a survey. I had to hang up on that. But, but yes, um, yeah. So. Yeah, so after, the after okay, so this happened Monday. On Tuesday morning, um, we actually went to the VA because that's where all her medical records and stuff at is. And they basically said she's fine and, you know, just stay healthy, stay hydrated. When they did her blood test and everything, it basically came back saying she was dehydrated. We don't necessarily know if it was the pre-workout, but we do know that probably was the cause because she didn't work it out. But just take care and of yourself. I did not, not drink enough water that day. That's basically what it was. Usually I drink a lot of water throughout the day, especially when I'm working out and or she like after eat. I work out and I didn't eat. She ate that one morning. little tinsy bitty hash brown. Yeah, so that was the problem, Harris Gang. So just this is awareness video and it's just like to let y'all know that something fucking crazy happened to us and something crazy happened to me within a short amount of time of me being home. But yeah, now I know and now I learned my lesson and that will never happen again. Mm -hmm. So yeah, knock on wood. But yeah, yeah. so Harris Gang, that's the end of our little story. Well, kind of like the beginning, but y'all mm -hmm. gonna see the rest on the video. We yeah. love y'all, Harris Gang. Yeah, we definitely um, love y'all. Make sure y'all, we gonna get our little live kinks worked out too. Yeah, I'm trying to work all, all that out. Make sure y'all follow us on all our platforms. We come with a mukbang tomorrow. We love y'all. <laughs>